Well, I, I think it's always our goal to play well in the middle of the week. The middle of the week, um, you know, can be the difference at the end of the year and you getting in or not based on how you play in the middle of the week. And I think it just shows that our guys understand that they have to focus and play good baseball and show up every day. And we knew that, uh, you know, coming in here into Charleston, anytime you can play on the road, you're playing in a big ballpark, playing against a good program like the Citadel, that we were going to be tested. But I think scoring early helped us a lot. You know, we scored a couple runs in the first, and uh, Higgy did a great job on the match and we were able to put some quality at bats together and score some runs and, and play a, a, a good game. Well, the biggest thing is we, we just got to prevent the big inning. We give up the big inning there in the uh, sixth, and, you know, that was ball game. Uh, but you got to credit Clemson. They made two really good defensive plays late in the game uh, or in the middle of the game that we had a chance, and, and uh, uh, you know, uh, the second baseman really hurt us right there. But, you know, they're a good, good ball club, and uh, our young pitchers didn't throw enough strikes, and they took advantage of it. It was great to see Jake Higginbotham uh, give, give us a good start. Uh, Bullpen-wise, we were able to throw a number of guys, which was our goal, and I thought Paul Campbell threw very well, and it was good to get, uh, get the old man, Patrick Andrews, out on the mound uh, and throw him for his first appearance of the year. So thought we threw the ball very well. Uh, made some really good plays defensively, and obviously we swung the bat very well. So I thought we played a complete game tonight. I have a lot of respect for, for Coach Jordan, his staff, and, and this is a great place to play. Uh, it's one of the best ballparks there is in the southeast, and you know what's better than playing in Charleston. So very happy to be in Charleston, and I think we most definitely uh, will talk to Coach Jordan, his staff, about trying to figure out how we can do it again in the future.